Hi, I'm Conrad Ries, and I'm a painter. Uh, my painting overload is in the show material witness at uh, the Berkeley Art Museum and Pacific Film Archive. Um, that shows up right now. <laughs> and um, this one for Summit Nada, and I'm having a good time here. So these are watercolors, and uh, I was a really big fan of the medium. I've been working at with it for some time. I was a big fan of um, Anthony Goicoli, a lot of his early drawings, and um, Tim Gardner, who was making these really small, um, these really small frat boy paintings. And I thought it was really important that he was making these like really delicate man paintings. And then I thought, well, if he gets to do that, why can't I make these like triumphant big watercolor paintings also? And and uh, that really seemed like a good idea. And um, and also, it was the reason to just start making it more bigger and bigger, which is what I was really after. I want to make this like a larger body of work, and yeah, it's something I've never seen before, so that was a good idea. <laughs> okay, so this is Daniel Gordon's photographs. Um, I've been looking at these, and these are seem to be very fun pieces that, like especially with this one right here, um, I've been looking at actually a couple of photographs in Flickr that um, of people like getting shot out of cannons, and this is kind of reminding me of of that where it's where it, they seem to be like landscape pieces, but at the same time they still have this little you know this little quick action thing going on, and I think that's um, very fun. It's a very fun body of work. And, it's really good. Ben Grasso is from Cleveland. He lives in New York right now. He's he has a amazing technique where he kind of takes these structures apart, and he does have this exploding house series. And um, these are one of his paintings. I've been looking at his work for some time. I think there's a lot of drawing skill that goes into this, but at the same time, they're very fun and painterly. And, um, like, I, I wish I could make these, so, uh, maybe in some ways I, I get to find my own explosions, but this is, this is awesome. Hi. Tamara. <laughs> uh, Kostianowski. Um, this is a great piece that we saw, and, what, uh, and this is the Y Gallery, and from New York, and I, I really, I really like how, um, this has this interesting feel where, it's, although it seems very realistic, it's also not at all because it's made out of fabric. Um, her clothes, we just learned. Um, and I like how it has this very bondage feel and like, it seems like the legs are spread. And this is uh, Karen Zogzon's work from Ambach and Rice in, uh, in Seattle. And um, it, these people, uh, I was talking to with the owner, and we we're talking about whether these pieces were actually smaller, smaller humans, these fictional beings, or um, maybe they were children. Um, and there's, it's really interesting with this body work that these people are forming together, but at the same time, the, the eyes are falling to the side, and they're they're falling apart as they're as they're running along, and. I was told that the the boxer, um, the, the artist was also a boxer for some time. So there is this element of athleticism I see that's um, that I see in the work.